ladies and gentlemen, you must respect the G20. The group of 20 industrialized and soon to be industrialized nations have your best interests at heart. You can't do that right here. You're within five meters of this wall, so please turn off your video camera. We can't film within five meters of the wall? No, that's correct. It, who's got, can you? Is he being detained right now? Or? So your friend didn't want to tell the police who he was, so he's been arrested for the time being. The Public Works Protection Act, as it's called, isn't new, but extending it broadly to downtown city blocks is unprecedented. Toronto has been turned into a police state. Ladies and gentlemen, Toronto is in police state lockdown. You are free to do as you are told. Do not rock the boat. Do not question authority. And there's no police at all, uh, at least not where we are, because there's broken windows everywhere all along the street. There's a cop car on fire. It just doesn't make sense. Then without warning, they started advancing and, and grabbing people randomly, and they started sending horses in, into the crowd. When you have that many police cars um, left in an area, and, and people see that there's no police stopping what's going on, you have to answer as to why that was. How an hour and a half of uh, destruction happens with police looking on and doing nothing, I find more than highly suspect. The police were ordered to stand down. Disengage! Disengage! Arrests, and lots of them. Hundreds at last count, over 500, and they are still making them as we speak. Touch me with that bubble. We're going into custody. They both do you understand? Everybody's going to be arrested? For what? Yeah, what? I told you, conspiracy to commit mischief, so stand here. We'll take you one at a time, okay? Thank you. I'm being taken. This is not North Korea. This is not China. This is a civilized Western nation where people are treated with respect and dignity. 1,100 people were arrested, the largest mass arrest in Canadian history. And what we've seen here is a picture of the police state to come. What happens when you give the police unlimited budgets? All the men they want, all the toys they want, all the machinery they want, and the right to control huge swaths of the city. Martial law set in the city of Toronto, leading to the most massive compromise of civil liberty in Canadian history. And we can never let that happen again.